Here is a quick demonstration video on how to access the templates for resume from the uh, placement cell blog page. So in the blog page, you can see the instructions regarding the resume. There are two types of uh, resume samples available, the sample one and the sample two. You can choose to use any one of the sample resume. Now here, there are separate button for creating the resume. So let us create a resume based on sample one. So you can click here and make a copy. And here you can rename it with your full name. And now for editing, now you have to understand that this entire uh, document is structured with the aid of a table. So for editing purpose, you can make the tables visible by right clicking and going to table properties. Here you can give the point as one point and save. So here now we can see that the borders are available. So while you are editing the information in this particular biodata, make sure that the tables, the binding lines are visible. Uh, the same thing can be done here also. You can right click, table properties, and one point, and leave OK. So now we can uh, neatly type in details here. And once all the details are filled in, you can again right click, table properties, and here you can make it as zero point and save. So it will be neatly formatted. So here also you can right click, table properties, zero point, and OK. So this is the way to edit this particular template. In case of a mobile device, we can create the resume easily by clicking the template options. So click on create a resume based on sample and then you can open the document in Google Docs. Okay, before uh, you can type the details and edit this document, what you have to do is you can go to the menu, share and export and you have to click on make a copy. Here you can rename your uh, resume with your name, for example. It's better to put your full name. So the a copy of this template is getting saved in your Google Drive. So now this is your resume. So you can edit here. So you have to click this edit button to start editing. So if you click here, now you can see the binding boxes of the table in the top and bottom. So that itself is a guide on what you are editing and how you are editing. And moreover, you can go to the menu and switch on the print layout to have a look at uh, how the resume is getting formatted. 
for editing purposes it is better to keep it in mobile view so that it is easily editable and after editing you switch on the print layout to see how the editing has 